Hello, um, this is going to be just a quick tour of the van. Um, in this video you'll see how it's going to be sold. So in the pictures, um, there's still a lot of my stuff in there, but this video will show you exactly what it will look like if you decide to purchase it with all the things that will be included and stuff. So yeah, we'll start off with the front. So let's just bam, pop it open. We'll jump in the front. So we are on 163,000 miles. I'm just gonna quickly start it, show you that. Starts up, no problems. Bam, there we go. No lights, nothing. Everything is working. Um, yeah, there is a slight um, like wobble in the steering wheel but I've just paid £300 for the fuel, not fuel, the power steering pressure pump that got replaced so maybe the lubrication just needs to catch up or the bearings might need to be checked but you know it drives absolutely fine um, also got a reverse camera here front and back, I just turned off uh, but yeah, there's front and back, it's a dash cam, so it records as well. Um, and yeah, got a little lock for the steering, and there is also some further security stuff, like a chain with a padlock, which um, fits exactly between the two doors, so if you wanted to chain it up from the inside, that is also possible. This chair folds down, um, that's the back of the van, but yeah, it can carry three people and it can also sleep three which we will get to in a secundo cool so the back of the van um fridge really cool fridge um you can get an app on your phone and control the temperature and stuff to be fair i've never used it but it is there if we put put the fridge on and pull it out there we go that's the fridge just needs a little clean but yeah that works um also got a little temperature thing battery percentage voltage voltage that's the fridge we've got some lights here there's a spare usb underneath and that is a light switch so if i flick that Ta -da! we got light there's another light over there um those connections just need read them in again very easy but yeah we'll turn this off cool we've got a little bench here little storage box also got some um oil and some power steering fluid uh here is the access point for the tanks for the sink so if i open this we've got two tanks fresh and wastewater it's a very very straightforward simple system there's just a um a foot pump on this side you know pumps the water from the fresh tank into the sink and then it drains into this one so just unhook that very easy to um, empty and all that and that sits just over there cool if we jump in i can actually show you the sink so i've got a worktop working area yeah and then you take this off got a really deep sink um yeah foot pump just literally push it and bam got running water cool um yeah so that's the sink we've also got two cupboards um nice big uh, storage box you can also have access to the leisure battery through here so you can probably see there's the leisure battery there's a fuse box over there as well um solar controller and emergency um switch so this this thing here comes out let it focus there we go this thing here comes out um and yeah if you wanted to take the battery out or do anything to the battery 
you know you can get into that space so yeah also got a double hob or a double cooker <clears throat> double gas stove bam that's going to come with the van did all my cooking on here a very good gas stove sits under there with some extra bulbs so yeah that's this side and then the other side has loads of storage um yeah for whatever you want really and this is where i had my fruits and veggies little little drawer little shelfy thing and yeah and kitchen towels and all that hang on here sweet um loads of storage under the bed there's some as the crates that i had my clothes in there is also a shower like a pressured shower so you heat up some water you pour it into the tank there's a foot pump you pump it up a few times so it's pressurized and you get a little holes with a little button and you know i've had decent showers with that so yeah another good thing um if i just turn turn my light on there we go so yeah some as the crates there's a the shower and those are from the side of the van you can stick them back on and that is a handle for the back and this over here is where i kept my bike there's a thing over there for the front forks to go on so the front tire comes off the bike slides in here and then the front fork goes onto there um and yeah so that is like the garage i guess the storage but we'll open the back doors so you can get a better look. Um, yeah, double bed. It's not a full size double bed. I had to chop it off a little bit because it didn't quite fit. But I am 5 foot 11 and I sleep comfortably on here. Um, there's also a hammock up here. So if you unroll this, um, you can sleep an extra person. So I have gone on a trip with two other people. So it was me two more people and we also have three dogs you know and we all slept in here comfortably we had two people in the bed one in the hammock and then we had the three dogs in the front so that's worked really well um so yeah there's also another hammock over here this is like a seating hammock and it hangs just over here um it actually attaches to the roof rack and it just dangles over there and yeah, it's a really nice little hammock. That's going to come with the van, with the pillows. And this hammock is going to come with the van as well. Open shelving at the top here. Spices. Um, remote for the light. There's some lights underneath there. Also got some lights wrapped around the hammock here. Let's chuck it on. Bam. There we go. And yeah, you can change the colour and all sorts. So, turn those off. Also a mounting thingy here that I mount onto these um, and it holds my iPad really well. So yeah, just lean up against here, watch some Netflix or whatever. Um, yeah, little shelves over here and these, I use these for cutlery and stuff. So yeah, this was my bookshelf and this was some more clothes and things. But yeah, that is pretty much the inside there's a little bin as well and yeah um cool gonna open up the back doors and show you the back so i've opened the back door from the inside obviously because the handles come off um but again easy fix you literally take this panel off um there's some insulation behind it but just take the right screws on the right side off this comes open this comes off and yeah you can just replace the handle oh crap <laughs> well i'll just put that in here <laughs> there you go i'll leave that there <laughs> um but yeah so open this other side opens here but yeah you get an idea of the, where the bike would go got a little broom that comes with the van it's a sick broom 
you know, it's brand new, so yeah, look after it. <laughs> uh, we've got two heavy duty drawers, like mega heavy duty. Um, I've been told that these drawers are worth around 450 quid. Um, yeah, they're, they're really good. So all these tools will actually come with the van. I might take some things out like this. This is my screwdriver and like little tools like that are going to come out. But the fuses and the wirings, the smart charger, there's some paint. This is for the fridge, some anti-slip mats. Um, yeah, some more wires and stuff. All that is going to stay. So if you wanted to do more work on the van, you know, feel free. Obviously, this van can can still have some things um, done to it to make it better. It's not perfect. But yeah, this will be all in here. And we've got another one. This is where I kept all my climbing gear. But now there's just some dehumidifiers and some... Um, whatever this is called. But yeah, got a little jack. And there should be all the tools for getting the wheels up and stuff for there. And the spare is underneath the tire. Cool. Um, there's also a roofy bit, like a little balcony. So let me shut these doors. There's a ladder on the back of here. And I'll show you the roof. Cool. So this is the roof. It's fully decked out, like the whole thing. 200 watt, I believe, solar panel this is. And that's pretty much that's up here. Um, yeah, super comfortable. I've camped up here a few times on um, clear starry nights. And yeah, one of my favorite things about this van for sure is this space. You could get a lot of people up here. You can have food up here, get some chairs and cushions and stuff. And yeah, it's a really nice um, chilling area. But yeah. That is pretty much it. There's a lot more stuff that I didn't talk about or cover. So obviously any questions and stuff, just hit me up and I will happily answer them. Um, yeah, cool. Hope you enjoyed the tour and yeah, hope you're interested in purchasing this beautiful vehicle. <laughs> cool. Peace.